Hello everyone, my name is David Tovar. I am a professor at the Universidad de La Sabana and researcher at the Planetary Science and Astrobiologic Group in, uh, at the National University of Colombia. So today I'm going to present the audiovisual material on forums as a pedagogic uh, tool for raising awareness among the public about the importance of astronomers and scientists in Colombia. So I'm going to start to share the, the, the screen and share with you uh, our experience working on this, uh, on this project. So in 2019 and 2020, the Planetary Science and Astrobiology Research Group of the National University of Colombia carries out different activities in science outreach, including the heroes in Colombia wear lab coats. This initiative arises as an educational and scientific outreach activity that helps to mitigate the lack of audiovisual material for the general public that has ceased to be uh, produced in Colombia due uh, to the pandemic. Heroes in Colombia where Lab Coat had uh, in its first season 12 guests doing research in astronomy, physics, chemistry, biology, and mechanical engineering. In our country, the most recognized people among Colombians uh, come from fields such as sports, mainly soccer, television, and film actors, and other people who work in entertainment. However, scientists are unknown by the vast majority of citizens, which motivates us to create this initiative. The videos are made in different country cities and in various settings, such as universities and public parks. In the first season, the cities chosen were Bogota and Leticia, the latter being the, of great interest since it is located next to the Amazon River in the middle of the South American jungle. The beginning of the video has an element to aim to hook the audience. The idea is that each scientist has a transformation in the best style of superheroes. Instead of wearing a cape, his change includes a lab code to contextualize the audience. The videos focus on three questions. How did the interest in science arise? Why is the research uh, you do in your field of study necessary? And how does your research contribute to Colombian society and humanity in general? Guests respond to these questions in a smooth conversation with the host who is usually a scientist from the Planetary Science and Astrobiology Research Group. Once the editing of the videos is finished, all the audiovisual material is shared on Facebook and YouTube. Additionally, it is shared with teachers from public and private schools to develop strategies in teaching natural sciences. On the other hand, the audiovisual strategy gives science an, an initiative of science outreach uh, during the pandemic. The format is different from that the heroes in Colombia were a lab code, since all the episodes were made virtually. The structure focuses on short talks and research topics that the guests have developed in the past or are cur currently working on. For this initiative, the guests included geologists, biologists, physicists, astronomers, and chemists. One of the advantages of this format is contacting people outside of Colombia and whose countries of origin were Mexico, Chile, Spain, Argentina, Brazil, and Puerto Rico. Once the videos were edited, they were also published in, on social networks, such as Facebook and YouTube. Additionally, teachers from natural science of public and private schools in Colombia were contacted to provide them with the videos and be used as a class material. In Santa Marta, a city in Colombia, the radio program Conscience of Universe has carried out wide, dis uh, wide dissemination of the audiovisual material of contact science. Thus, bringing science to children and young people of the Colombia Atlantic coast. Finally, the Tuesday of Coffee on Science is an in initiative that stands out for the interaction of the attending public with different scientists who are invited to the meetings. This activity began in 2016. Currently, its high impact on the university community and the general public of Bogota City led to this activity be being carried out in conjunction with the Central Library of the National University of Colombia. There, the guests have 45 minutes to make a brief introduction to the topic. Then the audience in the conversation mode 
ask questions and, and discuss the subject. Several of the sessions deal with astronomy topics such as cosmology, universe evolution, planet formation, and stellar evolution. All this is accompanied by, the, by an excellent Colombian coffee. So finally, I would like to uh, invite you to uh, follow us in our uh, social networks, such as Facebook and YouTube, and um, at Twitter as well. And then if you have any questions, please uh, do not hesitate to make those questions at the end of this session. That's it. Thank you so much for your attention.